Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jonah. You can also call me Cat Dad Sims. And today I wanted to do something a little different from what I've been posting lately. And if you've seen my previous video where I let The Sims 4 regenerate the Caliente family, I kind of wanted to do the same thing with other families in The Sims 4. As well as um, families like the pancakes where they don't have a history in the sims they're new to the sims 4 they're a new family they don't have a family tree or any kind of story to them that was in the previous iterations so i wanted to do I like hmm, i'm not sure where they are on this family tree all i know is that they are going to be maybe the great grandfathers and the great grandmothers of um, Eliza and Bob Pancakes. So, um, the first grandparent and grandfather, or maybe even the great, I'm not sure, were, uh, the Pancakes. So, Bob Pancakes' great grandparents or grandparents I haven't decided. I'm gonna do this as like a, like a let's play, I guess. So, my Caliente video, that was... I played all of that off camera because um, I had a, a YouTube channel at the time, but I wasn't updating it or taking it seriously. Or I mean, I, I don't take this one seriously, but you know, I wasn't like, oh, I should make this into a video and make this and do a video out of this. So I just played the Caliente family off camera. I just wanted to, them to have a family tree and um, just really re redo the Caliente family because. Are the Caliente family a hot mess? So, uh, yeah, the first person I'm making is Auto Pancakes. He's lazy. Um, I think that's creative and family oriented. And at first I was like, mm, I should make their clothing a little bit dated because, you know, they're going to be like the great grandparents of the grandparents. But we don't have a whole... But we don't have a whole lot of clothing in that style, so I was just like, you know what, it's The Sims, it doesn't really matter. So I, I just dressed them up as I would with any other Sim, and yeah, I, I intend this to be like a, a legacy Let's Play, I, I suppose. So, I'm like the Caliente family, which I could only show what happened afterwards. This one I actually want to do on camera, and and record the gameplay and I'll have them have kids and eventually it will lead up to Eliza Waffles and Bob Pancakes and eventually they'll get married and I, wa I want to get them to that storyline that they have in Sims 4 where their marriage is struggling and I also want them to have a toddler because um, yeah after the toddlers were released uh, they we released the pancake family on the gallery with a toddler so Bob and Eliza had a toddler to try and save their marriage and you, you know that ain't gonna work so yeah this is a uh, Bob pancakes great grandmother or grandma I really I'll just call them grandparents for now so this is Marissa pancakes and again I just I want to let the game do all the genetics so like down the line I don't know what Bob Pancakes is gonna look like the same thing with what happened with the Caliente family I wasn't sure what they were gonna look like but I let the game genetics do their thing and they turn out really good and I, and I like how they look and that's how I wanted them to look and I think I just had to change like some hair color and I definitely changed their clothing because you know the randomization on the clothing ain't any good in this game. But yeah, they were all made just from the genetics of The Sims 4 and, and I want to do the same thing with the pancakes so... The story I, like, I have for the waffles and the pancakes is probably going to be in a thumbnail. I kind of want to have like, I don't know, like a rivalry between the two families. I was kind of thinking like a Romeo and Juliet story where 
these two families have been feuding forever and the pancakes don't like the waffles and the waffles don't like the pancakes. And eventually Eliza and Bob, they kind of hook up and they, they have that honeymoon period where they're just so in love and, and they would do anything for each other, kind of like Romeo and Juliet. But the twist on that is Romeo and Juliet, if they grew up and they were both alive and they lived to be married and lived with each other, I think they would eventually well, not despise each other, but they would have a falling out because Romeo and Juliet, they were like, they were horny teenagers, let's be real. And horny teenagers, they don't have any clue about what real relationships are and what real commitment is. And ooh. So yeah, that's the kind of the, the gist of the storyline that I was kind of going with Eliza and Bob. So they come from like rival, rival, ah, rivaling families. They get together, they have that nice honeymoon period. They're so in love, they do anything for each other. And as the years go on and their marriage goes on, yeah, they kind of fall out of love. So this is uh, Denise Waffles. Um, yeah, I'm hoping that red hair passes on. The husband is gonna be brunette and she's gonna be a redhead. And I also wanna make like, I need other townies, so I'm probably gonna fill up um, Rilla Creek with some other townies that they can get with because I do need them to have kids and those kids need to marry and eventually lead to Eliza and Bob. So I'll probably... Usually sometimes I just take Sims off the gallery. That's probably what I'll do. Yeah, this is Earl Waffles. So both of these, they're both s snobs. They're both like old money and they have a... Uh, I mean... I'm gonna build their houses later. I wanna build their houses with the starter funds. So they, I mean, I say they're old money, but I, when I play this game, they're gonna start out with starter funds. They're gonna start with the starter home. And I'm gonna play the game like it's meant to be played where you don't have cheats. You just kind of go up the career and you have kids, etc., etc. So, I mean, let's just say they're they're the snobs. They're not particularly rich, but they're snobs. So yeah, uh, right now Denise Waffle, she has vegetarian, screamish, and perfectionist, but later on, and I think I kept the footage, I switched the vegetarian to snob because I don't see her being a vegetarian at all. And I, and I tried to remember to go through all the outfit categories and put wedding rings on because they are married. It's, it's not going to be like a strict legacy because I think the legacy rules you have to start out with one sim, that sim has to marry on in the game. I'm starting out with two sims, both married, and I don't intend to do 10 generations with them. I, I just want like a decent, like, a decent family tree. Because that's the one thing that Sims 4 is missing is this family trees and having a, a good story and a background for all these characters. And when you actually play with the characters like fresh like this and you have that storyline in the back, gameplay is so much more funner. I had so much fun playing with a Caliente family when... I had generation after generation of the Calientes and I had that storyline in the back. And that's kind of what I, what I want to do with the waffles versus the pancakes and I think that's why I'm going to name it. You'll see the title when you know it goes up, but that, yeah, I think that's what I want to name it. So I'm just going to go through, um, yeah, here, here's going to fix it. Okay, so I'm going through all their outfit categories just really quick, just so... I mean, sometimes people just skip to the end of the video, but hey. This is all their outfits. This is Marissa and Otto Pancakes. They're going to be either the great-grandparents or the grandparents of Bob Pancakes. 
So I will definitely post the their house build video later. I still gotta build the houses. I'm having a really hot, tough time with Victorian style homes because Victorian slash Queen Anne homes are really hard to do with starter funds. So yeah, I'm having a bit of a difficulty there. Yeah, this is Denise and Earl Waffles, and this is all their outfits. And yeah, I really hope that you enjoyed this video, and I hope to see you in the next part. Bye.